What's going on everyone and welcome back to the channel. A new banner is coming this Friday in the Miracle Wishes with a new hero as well. This is a not a limited hero, but we don't have the details yet. So maybe tomorrow we are going to have the skills of the hero and talk about him. We are going to have the return of Dez and Bofani in the same banner, Nilua and Nark. Uh, but I'm not going to summon on that banner because I save all my Miracle Wishes for the limited heroes only because today we have one new limited hero every month or uh, uh, two months so this is better to save everything generally for the new banners but who know maybe GLC is gonna be game changer we are gonna see that tomorrow so generally both Fanny and Dez are used in that content only if you ch are checking that you are gonna have some damage increase on your direct damage team using both of them but you are gonna need to use both of them with three exclusives which is a lot so if you have them this is great if you want to pull for them this is great as well you are gonna have way more damage thanks to that. Then I don't know about the other contents in the game, maybe they are gonna be good in Dwarven Ruins versus Ifrit or uh, Growlen in a direct damage team, but I can't tell you I don't have them and nobody is using them today because everybody that is farming that stage have all the limited heroes and so this is the only way today that people are using to kill this, to beat this kind of content. Nilua is great in every 3v3 or 5v5 content in PvP and you can find some in the top rankings. If you are trying to control that team for example with a Nazil or the imprison of a Lydia, if they take the first turn she's gonna take the second, she's gonna cleanse herself and use the ultimate to cleanse your entire team and lower the turn meta by 50% of one target in front. This is a great hero for that. And you are gonna find her in advanced arena, guild arena, championship teams, I'm using her as well, in the war of thrones and the fair arena. And finally, Nark can be used maybe in the Wuthering Coast, but I don't have him and nobody is using a bleed team today. Or they are using other heroes in Dwarven Ruins, maybe versus Rom and Nejia. He is going to be great to defeat waves and the two minions on the boss wave as well. But I would love to try that, but I don't have that. So I hope that in the future I'm going to have a pack with him inside. And so I'm finally going to be able to try him correctly. We have a new code to redeem as well as spring 2024. We are going to get a 5 star dragon egg, 10 million gold and 1 regression potion. So as always, click on your avatar settings. You paste that code. Okay. And you can redeem your rewards. And this is what you're going to get. So we have a new event, that one in which we have to select three heroes, one per phase. You need to water the plant multiple times to make it grow. You can select these heroes in the first phase, so I decided to pick Sana in case I have enough resources to get, uh, to get her. It's gonna be the first exclusive and I want to try her, now she has a buff. And then on the second one you can select these heroes. And on the third one, you can select every single limited hero, but not the last one we had recently, Beatrix. And you have limited time echoes inside of it as well. If I had to recommend one to you, first concentrate on Nicholas until you have the exclusive 3. Once you have the exclusive 3, you want to acquire Lydia until she is exclusive 2 to get the cooldown reduction over time during the fights. This is the best one you want to have. Once you have that, you want to focus on Little Jack until you have at least the exclusive 2 to increase the mastery of all your heroes for PvE. And then, once you have all these 3, you can decide whether you want to push more content in PvE or PvP. But for PvP, the best one to have is probably Sun Wukong today and Pauline to cleanse. The exclusive 3 is great on that guy. And then maybe Jack and Roll is the best pick or maybe Jingle Bell and finally you want to have these but at the end. In my opinion, let me know what you think about that in the comment below. And then you have different Echoes. That one is great to power up your Nita, so she might have enough damage to kill Sun Wukong teams in PvP and deal more damage in PvE as well. That one is the best one to increase your direct damage. So if you're using a Jingle Bell or a hero like this, maybe you can try to use one of these too. If you have at least one of it on your Nicholas, you are going to increase a bit more your damage. This is going to be great for PvE and PvP as well. That one on your Little Jack and then that one on your uh, Jack and Roll. And then the others, it's just some extra stats stuff on your heroes. That one is great if you have a Nesta to have a bit more damage as well, but mainly for PvP in my opinion. So you are starting with 13, so you can get some Aura Runes 
on the second phase, that's pretty cool, and on the last phase you have some gear, the piece you want. You are not gonna get some extra daily, you can buy one daily for 200 diamonds during 7 days, so normally at the end of the week, if you are buying only the ones you have in the resource store, you should be able to clear to complete the first phase. You can buy some extra in the shop, so you have 3 for 1 dollar only. You have a $20 pack to get some more in there and you have 62 for $70. So if you are planning to spend in the game, make sure that you are using Aptoid. If you are using that, you are gonna pay 65 euros. For example, you are gonna get 10 euros in cashback and then you are gonna be able to reuse that cashback to buy other stuff for free in the game. Don't forget as well to use my promo code ACTARIMR5 during that period between April 1st and April 12th. You are gonna get 5% extra cashback as well and if you are using it this is also a way to support my channel so thank you to everyone who is using my promo code during that period so in my case i'm gonna buy that pack for 20 dollars i got my cash back and when you have enough cash back you can pay directly using your cash back and in fact that pack i'm buying it for free and i'm gonna pick that one as well If you want to know how to install and use Aptoid, feel free to contact me. My ID Discord is in the description below. You have as well a video guide on how to use it in the description below. So I have 35, I'm gonna spend some more, I'm gonna complete that phase, I'm gonna get my copy of Sana, I think. Yes, that is the case. And now to complete the second phase, I need to use 40. So let's do some more like this. I have six left and I need 20 in total. So I'm gonna lack 14. I feel a bit sad now because I'm gonna have to wait four days if I buy the other pack for 10 euros. If I want to show you how much we need to complete the third phase and obtain the limited hero, but probably it's gonna increase by an extra 20 and maybe you are gonna need 60 to complete the third phase and obtain the limited heroes. Let me know in the comment below if you complete that. I'm gonna pin your comment to the video. So I'm just gonna do the six remaining I have. And for $20, this is the rewards I had. Why not? And then you have that event. You need to complete some daily quests to get some more rewards inside. And at the end, you get some runes for auras. This is cool. And so you just have to clear some dungeon stages, arena battles, and complete some battles in the Tower of Mark as well. So the rewards are free for everyone and this is cool. And we have the return of the magical clear as well and there is no limited hero or other hero inside of it. So if you want to know how to clear many stages really easy in that content, I made another video so just have a look on my channel, you are gonna find it super easy. And clear every round within 8 moves or 9, if you are not lucky. And basically I'm always starting at the top like this. If I have that one, I put it there, I'm using that there, the uh, bar over there, that one here, that one there, and generally I need another one there, but I'm not lucky enough to get it, so I'm just gonna use that there. I have it now, I'm gonna use that, nine moves only. Now, I just have to repeat, I have that one, I'm putting it there. Okay, I wasn't lucky that time. So I'm just gonna use that over there, now I have the one at the top, I'm gonna use that one over there that one here there we go and one more time i wasn't lucky but i'm just wasting one piece so it's okay i'm gonna have it in nine turns so guys that was all for the video i hope you enjoyed it if it's the case don't forget to like comment and subscribe have a nice day and see you in the next one bye bye